Come on in and welcome to my channel. Today I want to talk about themes. Does your channel have a theme? Do you need to have a theme? And the answer to that is no, you don't need to have a theme. I mean, realistically, what is a theme? What is the overall purpose of your channel? What is the overall purpose of all of your videos? Now, if you've been around all of my channels, they all have the same thing going for them. And what is that you say? It's simple. My overall theme in all of this is you don't have to be perfect. There is no need to be perfect. I do not even try to be perfect. Anybody who knows me will tell you that that one's really true. I actually show you my mistakes. I keep in my flaws, my stuttering, unless it's something hideously bad and then I will edit it out. Uh, all of my editing isn't perfect simply because What's the perfect of what's the point of being absolutely perfect? You don't need to do that. I used to be one of those people who I would see a recipe and I would have to copy it so it looked exactly like it did on the card and it had to look beautiful and everything had to be perfectly set and matched and everything. And I found out something. Guess what? It, it wasn't real. There are people behind the scenes who do all of that for people. There are food stylists, there are people who are actually the food that you might be seeing might not even be real food. One of the big things I've been finding out recently, or actually not recently, I've known it for a while, a lot of times those cherry pies that you see aren't real because what it is is it's done by a food stylist who uses something to make the pie look perfect. And you can also do things in Photoshop. No, no. I mean, people will drive themselves crazy to try to get the perfect everything. And that can be a problem with your channel. You might decide you're going to wait until you have everything absolutely perfect and then you'll go with it. Or you might do a take which you do 30 to 40 times until you get the wording just absolutely perfect. Why? There is no happiness in perfection. I've said this before where I've talked about when people actually go out and meet me and they say you talk just exactly like you do on your videos. And it's true simply because I leave in my stuttering, my breathing, the fact that occasionally I have to swallow simply because that's who I am. I am not perfect. I do not attempt to be perfect. And it makes my editing and my life so much easier by not doing that. Being perfect can drive people absolutely insane and it's not real. I know a lot of videos, and I probably have stopped watching most of the channels that do this, that edit their videos down within an inch of their life so that that way it doesn't seem like they actually even breathe. Why? You do breathe. I know that you breathe. They're saying that you need to cut out anything which is not needed and not related. Well, no. No, you don't. You have to cut out anything which you feel is not needed. Not everything. Uh, be real. How is it easy to be real if you're going to edit anything out of you that's imperfect? You're, you're not. You, you can't laugh at your mistakes. You can't do silly things like if I were a normal person, I would uh, edit, edit out all the talking that I do with my hands. But in real life, I talk with my hands. That's one of the things that I do. So feel free to find your overall theme. Like I said, my overall theme in all of this is to not be perfect, to make mistakes. It doesn't have to look like you know it, everything was just done perfectly. It just has to look like everything was done for you by you. Yeah, that's one of the things you need to think about. Well, what do you think about that? I've said this before about not being perfect. Yes, I'm rubbing my eyebrow and I'm going to leave that in there. I've said this before about not being perfect, but you don't have to be perfect on your YouTube channel. Be you. Let us know about you in your YouTube channel. That's important. Those little imperfections are part of you. So do that. Let me know down in the comments what you think about this, and I hope I get to see you again next time. If you like this, remember to subscribe. Just click on my face. Every week it's a different video to help you with your production. And also remember to check out the other videos in this series and on this channel.